Orange Democratic Movement and the Building Bridges Initiative Secretariat is expected to file an appeal against last week's High Court ruling that declared the entire BBI process an illegality. Attorney General Kihara Kariuki has already filed a notice of appeal for the ruling that continues to attract varied reactions from the political class. A declaration is hereby made that the president does not have authority under the constitution to initiate changes to the constitution and that a constitutional amendment, amendment can only be initiated by parliament through a parliamentary initiative and article 256. The ruling on Thursday appears to have split the political class right in the middle. Proponents of the referendum aggrieved by the ruling, accusing the five-judge bunch of usurping the constitution and exposing President Tuhuru Kenyatta to possible litigation. Those allied to Deputy President William Ruto are in a celebratory mood, hailing the judgment as an intervention meant to end wastage of government resources through an unnecessary bid for law reform. The Orange Democratic Movement, a key stakeholder in the BBI process, and the BBI Secretariat, co-chaired by former Dagoretti South MP Dennis Wawero and Minority Whip in the National Assembly, Jeanette Mohammed, are expected to file an appeal against the decision today. The Secretariat alleges bias on the side of the judges whom they accuse of engaging in extra legal issues or delivering the ruling. And while the Attorney General Kihara Kariuki filed a notice of appeal yesterday, a member of the defunct BBI steering committee, who is also the Samburu woman rep, Mason Leshomo, faulted the High Court ruling, saying Kenyans participated in the BBI process through public participation. <laughs> Two MPs from the Ukambeni region, while speaking separately, have differed sharply over the fate of a BBI process. Kitu East MP in Mumbai pointing his finger at ODM leader Raila Odinga, accusing him of exposing Kenyans to an unnecessary and illegal bid to change the constitution for political gains. Wale watu wawili wenye wanakubaliwa na wako na rusa ya kubalisha katiba. Kwa sababu katiba ni ya wananchi ni wananchi wenyewe through kupitia ile popular initiative na na wambunge wambunge ambao wamechaguliwa kufanya ile representative democracy ya, ya kuja kuwakilisha wale wananchi wenyewe kwa mbunge His mwingi West counterpart Charles Nguna however is optimistic that the country will hold a referendum before August this year The pres the president was not the promoter of BBI president only facilitated in BBI uh, documentation. He, he just gave his opinion just like any other Kenyan. Now, moving on, the number of learners at 